Hello guys, here we have one of the wonders of modern retail. It is a card reader. It enables most people to be able to take card payments anywhere, anytime. Uh, it links to your mobile phone. This little device is Bluetooth. This one is by SumUp and they call it the Air Reader. PayPal do one, lots of other ones. Square I think do one. Fundamentally, it's a card reader press the button on the side it powers up like so okay so someone comes along with a card they can tap to pay if the tap doesn't work they can slide the card in the top there and do it the old-fashioned way like lots of Americans do and have to type in their pin number <laughs> alternatively you can go really old school and swipe your card through there and read the magnetic strip on the back How do these work? What do they look like inside? Aren't you intrigued? I know I am. Oh yeah! So, I'm gonna bust this one open. Three, two, one. Yep, I busted it. Let's get this baby open. There we are. Hmm, a lot more circuitry than I imagined. What have we got going on here? So there's the USB port for charging. Hmm. That thing there looks like the scanner for reading the magnetic strip when you pass your card through. And down in there is where you would slot your card like so. Looks like I bust it so hard, I bust the power lead straight out of this lithium polymer battery. Hmm, lithium polymer or lithium iron? Hmm, can't really tell. So, looks like a single cell, so that's 3.7 volts. And that connected to this power point here. Positive and a negative went in there like that. Mm. It is actually a lot more advanced than I imagined. So, oh look, I've really broke it. This thing ain't going to work anymore. Now, really intriguing is this. This little thing there is effectively like some sort of foul safe anti tamper device fuse. So, between here and here these two points, let's try and get that focused, is a, a sponge sort of strip, but it is conductive and that sits inside this moulding in this position here, like so. And then that circuit board sat on there and what happened was that little conductive strip bridged across these two terminals and being a sponge like surface it was pushed onto there and bridged across I guess completing the circuit and of course when I bust this open this come apart and this no longer works now what I don't know is if that makes a permanent foul or whether if I was to put this back together, it would work. Who knows? Hmm. So, just so you know, that's the back of your sum up card reading machine, and this sticky label can be peeled off, like so, revealing two screws. These are little Torx head screws. So, should you wish to get inside,
there's your access points. So there you have it, the inside of your sum up card ready machine. I'm going to put this thing back together. We'll just throw all the bits in, like so. And then on the count of three, three, two, one. Voila! So, there you have it, your sum up card reading machine. Couldn't recommend it highly enough. These things have been superb for me. They're quick, reliable, and the payment system, getting the money to you works really well. There you go. The only thing I couldn't recommend is breaking it apart. Don't do that, kids.